ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K23, man. Y'all already seen the title. I've been I've been silent long enough. I got to speak my mind on this joint, man. It's just come to a head. I ain't going to be quiet no more. I ain't, gonna, I, ain't, I ain't doing it no more. Anyway, man, but before we get started, make sure y'all like the video and comment mind down below that's gonna do two things for y'all man number one well we at the end of the month and uh we're not averaging 8k views so the next gen console won't be a thing maybe we can do better next month all y'all gotta do is like the video and comment something anything and i'm even telling y'all what to comment it can't get easier than that man that's number one number two every single friday we give away 50 dollars of vc cash out or we give away a copy of a video game man so for, so for your chance to win that Make sure y'all just comment down below anything really or like and also like the video so I know that you want to do it. Last but not least, the bots are down there. I think I have abolished and banned all the bots. But just in case you see somebody saying hit me up on Telegram or, or telling you that that's, that's my phone number. They got an iPad and a, I, a, I something for you. iCloud, I would. I don't know. It doesn't matter what they say. Just know it's not me. And with all that out of the way. Good morning out there in 2K land, man. Actually, man, one thing we want to do. Hey, real quick, a moment of silence for this right here, bro. If you grew up in the 80s, 90s, and all of that good stuff, early 2000s, this is going to hit you different right here, man. How do I say goodbye to what we had? Hey, check it out, man. These guys, East Bay will be closing at the end of the month. Iconic memories y'all even remember that lebron james joint man big dreams uh dream big dream often man that, that was like it's crazy like i don't understand i don't know if y'all understand how big that is some of y'all sitting there in the comment section you're probably young and you like hey old head what are you talking about i ain't never heard of no east bay or none of that stuff man only thing i want only thing i know about is online or i just go to the east bay online and to that i say shut the f up shut the f let me have my nostalgic moment. Let, Let me have my nostalgic old head moment where I say back in the day, we didn't have no internet. The only thing that we had was the East Bay Magazine. And if you had that on the bus riding home, not only were you a target because somebody was gonna try to take it from you, but at the same time, simultaneously, you were the most popular kid on the bus because everybody was gonna sit beside you and try to look at some shoes that none of us was gonna grit. Why? Because I'm broke, I'm broke. That my mama ain't getting them shoes, but you can look at them and dream, man. That's how we used to dream back in the day, boy. If you used to dream, a uh, dream big and dream often with East Bay, that was a dream. It wasn't dreaming getting to the league, you were dreaming about getting them shoes. But if you if you used to dream big and dream, dream often with East Bay, hey, put that East Bay down there in the comment section, man, because I definitely did all so many childhood memories on the bus and all that good stuff. But into, anyway, man, let's just get straight into the stuff that we talking about today, bro. Check it out. My boy T. Misley, he says, hey, man, T. Misley, so grizzly. He says, I got to stop arguing in the same chat with dudes who have to whisper because their parents are asleep. Don't them kids be talking so reckless, bro? They be sitting there talking so reckless, so gangster. You would think that they got all the all the stuff that T, all that artillery that T.I. had and some more. That's what you would think, and they gonna use it. Like, you would really think that they be talking so greasy, so gangster, boy, you know they ain't gonna bust a great, like what, like what Ziggly Wiggly said, you ain't gonna bust a great at a fruit fight. You ain't gonna throw rice at a Chinese wedding, and that's mandatory and hard. That is Ziggly Wiggly, man. Hey, but you know, it is what it is, man. Up next, we got, we got, uh, we got the girl Queen Bear. Uh, well, Queen. Uh, why are we calling her Queen Bear? Queen R. Uh, she says, "Stop stressing and leave them. Stop stressing and leave them in 2K. I mean, in, <laughs> I'm talking about 2K. Everything 2K. Stop stressing and leave them in 2022. Queens and Queens. No time for playing in 23." got goals to reach now i'm one of them people i'm a big advocate for like i do i do understand some people do they 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 like to leave stuff in in the new you know new year new new year new me new whatever i'm i'm one of those people that i'm like this new day new me new hour new me new second new me i feel like i can turn myself around and head in a different direction at any time a lot of people do like to load it up and and do it at the beginning of the year but if i acted like that i wouldn't be looking why i wouldn't be ripped like i am right now every every week it's a new challenge just like just like day storm used to be another day another challenge so let's get it that's how we do man but you know it is what it is man hey Anytime somebody is for self-improvement and trying to do better, I'm all for it. It don't matter if you do it every day, every second, every hour. I can't make it without the sunshine. 
that, but yeah, what? Hey, let me know what that song from, man. I might, I might hook you up down in the comment section. Up next, but yeah, anytime self improvement. Let's get it, Queen. Hey, up next, we got uh luck i i, I keep wanting to call him luck df it's luck tv man he says did anyone get nba 2k 23 for christmas i usually see people post that they got it but this year i haven't seen i have seen nobody literally nobody if you did let me know and a lot of people talking about you know they said not nba 2k 23 uh but nba 2k 22 so at least it's some. Somebody got 22? Bro, I ain't gonna lie. I already know how that be, man. Sometimes your grandmama, you should go in this store and she buy you something or whatever like that. And, uh, you know, that, that's all they do. They just buy whatever they buy. And and they be like, you know, here you go, baby. I mean, here you go, baby. You know, you know, you got that. And, and they do buy you something that, you, that might be a year old or whatever. But, hey, it's grandma. We appreciate it. You know what I'm talking about? My grandma couldn't even buy me no video games because they wasn't out when she was around. So, you know, it is. Well, well they were, but they were not in the comparison. They were around and they were out in the compassion, but you weren't gonna sit around the house all day and play that game in 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 uh in her house. So that just is what it is, man. Up next, we got that boy Solo saying rate NBA 2K23 on a scale of one to ten and grinding says eight. I actually love this game. I play it every day. Minus two, uh minus two, because the legend rewards killed my motivation to grind. But the game is um, the game itself is fun, and I do agree with that. I give it an eight, man. In the beginning, I was gonna say, you know, we was giving it a nine or, you know, something like that, 8.5. But, yeah, it's a solid 8. And um, we're going to talk about why that is in a few minutes, man. Up next, hey, Laker fan says, way too many people show me love. This is something that he, going along with what T was talking about. Way too many people show me love and respect for me to take to, to take the hate seriously. I've wavered away from this way of thinking from time to time. We all do. But I see, it's pretty, I see it pretty clearly these days that I've built some real stuff out of my community. I got to get more interactive lately though and i think that's all of us man like at this point in uh, this time of year you know what we're doing is we just trying to grind the content grind the content i think the community aspect and all of that stuff it comes later and i think that we're gonna get there and like i said we're gonna be start doing some of these uh tournaments and some of the leagues and stuff i'm gonna try to hook, hook something up that y'all gonna be interested in but i gotta put on for y'all because y'all been putting on for me but y'all gotta really put on me for me by hitting that like button man that's what y'all really gotta do up next we got that boy orange afro says people are terrible at this game i hate losing or having close games with people that are terrible can't stand it joe no says 2k is 2k <laughs> 2k bro i can only control what you can control sometimes that's why i don't sweat stuff just use it for what you need it to be and that's what it is man we got to use this thing as a as a as a you you use it some people use it as a platform for elevation some people use it to support their family some people like me i just use it for a little extra cash from time to time i like to buy an extra cheeseburger or something like that because with the money i make after i give y'all y'all 50 dollars a week allowance that's all i got hey up next man we got that boy oh, oh, oh hold on hold on we got the wrong one oh uh, we got that boy laker fan saying these videos is hidden and more or less what he's got he's got he's got his um his pro-am stuff, man. And, you know, he's just showing, hey, them joints hitting and they got legs and they're growing. And then uh, Paul comes in, Paul Geo says, it's amazing that a game mode that gets zero investment from 2K can be, be so valuable for content. I don't think pro-am has been updated in eight years. Sorry to divert. I know, I know, um, I know not everyone can have a success with pro-am like you. Super happy that you're crushing it, my guy. And I beg to differ. I'm gonna tell y'all why. Because pro-am, Y'all, y'all, he say Pro-Am got zero investment in eight years. I would argue that Pro-Am is the most updated game mode in here because this game is Pro-Am centric. The game is literally built around Pro-Am. That's why when you go out in the park, the 3v3, it don't really work that much. The, you know what I'm saying? The ones, you see all the T's in the game. Uh, the twos, you see all the T's in the game. Threes, you see a lot of T's, but it's, it's less. But on the fives, that's where the game really shines. And that's what the game is made for. They actually even made a whole Pro-Am mode you know, different modes and stuff like that for the professional pro-am and stuff like that. Like the game pro-am definitely been updated. Now, if you want to talk about visually and stuff like that, I don't know that there's so much, there's much, very much that you could do to update it, but the game is literally pro-am. This game is for pro-am and for rec and stuff like that. If you don't like the game, if you dislike the game, if you're having a hard time, you just feel like I just, I just, this game is just complete trash. Go play some pro-am and play some rec because this game is a very five centric game. So uh, yeah, I, I don't know exactly what he's trying to say there but i think that a lot of y'all probably understand what i'm saying and you agree with me on that up next we got that boy ej saying just because another content creator is doing the same thing that you are doing 
doesn't make them competition. And you're right about that, man. Listen, bro. When we look at news outlets, we got CNN, CNBC, um, you got you got uh, Fox, you got all these other stations, Channel 2 Action News, all that stuff. You got so many things. People don't just look. When people look for content on a subject, they don't want to just look at one perspective. They want to look at several perspectives. So, like, I might talk about the, the pay to win aspect of the game and then they want to see what brute want to think about it too that don't make me and him competition if i make a jump shot video that's not competition it's just saying like his jump shot didn't work for me so i'm happy that there are a variety of things out there you just provide more of a variety so like even if even like with the desi banks video like a lot of people did that video i ain't in competition with them people i just did it because it was fun for me you know what I'm saying? If it don't do nothing, it don't do nothing. But like, you just, you gotta look at, stop looking at it like that because we are not com in competition with each other. It's like Picasso said, good artists, good artists borrow, great artists steal. So if somebody's doing something and you in the same lane and it's working for them, maybe you should dip your toe in there and give it a try. And hey, maybe that might be your lane. Maybe it not, might not be. I might drop a pro-am build or a pro-am video or pro-am something and it might not do anything at all, but at least I tried and it gave me another experience. So, you know, I'm down with that, man. Hey, we not, y'all got me, yeah, boy, I'm, I'm rocking with EJ this morning, man. You are not in competition with nobody, bro. All we're doing, all we doing, is uh, doing stuff. And last but not least, man, check this out, man. This boy IQ contain. I, I I don't know if he's crying or he's just laughing or whatever, but it's not a laughing matter, in my opinion. Uh, this is what we came here to talk about. I was just in a game, a game chat, playing with a 60 year, a 60 overall on stream, and he told me that his parents bought him a PS5, NBA 2K23, but no VC. I actually feel bad. And it does feel bad, man. And this is what we're talking about, the pay to win aspect of this game. Let's like, look, my son, my son, uh, he, don't, he don't play 2K and stuff like that. He's not on these games yet. Right now, he was he, all he wanted to do was play World Gone Sour. That game came out in 2011. I found it, downloaded it for him, put him on his computer. He's been playing that game at full potential for the last few days, right? No problem at all. He, I mean, literally 24 hours a day playing it. Then I also got a Miles Morales. He's playing that. He's able to play the game. I've been playing Call of Duty. A lot of people got Call of Duty. Listen, bro, there is no reason that you should buy a console and buy the game and still have to buy the juice. You can't even enjoy my career without the juice. Why do you have to buy this and buy that and then have to sit there and try to grind up the VC to try to be able to even enjoy the game, bro? It is, it is insane. It's insane. I do understand that it's a business model, and we're to blame, and we've done all of this. But Jesus, bro. Now, one thing I will tell you, we shouldn't have to grind all the way. You can't even enjoy the offline mode without buying the juice. The pay-to-win aspect in this game is just crazy. Now, I myself would never come out to the park or be in a game chat with somebody at 60 overall. And I bet... I bet they didn't just buy him the regular edition of summer. He got some VC somewhere and he probably dripped out. I bet he was swagged out in there. But at the same time, it's just crazy. Like, like you get the game and you can't even really enjoy it off the bat. That's why when they're talking about free to play, the free to play part don't really move me. It's the character. Like if you buy the game and they give you a starter character or something, they got to give you a jumping off point or something, bro. But at the same time, I do understand what they saying. They want you to grind it up like my career. You're supposed to be completing other and then get better then get better but bro you gotta get the game that's why that's that's the part that me and t are saying turns a lot of people off from the game they don't care about the price of the game nobody ever said i, I don't want to pay 60 dollars for 2k the problem is always that you have to pay for the game and then you got to pay for the juice and guess what after you get to 99 you get to buy more juice in the form of boost and stuff like that. So that little kid was saying, he probably was like, yeah, I got the PS5, you know, that's five, six hundred dollars and my parents bought me 2K, you know, that's like 50, 60, 70 dollars, but they wasn't able, they, they didn't get me no VC, not because they couldn't afford it, because they bought all this stuff, so obviously they can, they just weren't aware of the V-sizzle. And hey, if they're not aware of the juice and you try to make them aware of the juice, then you might go back to them and then they're just going to be like, you you ungrateful, you ungrateful so-and-so. Why is you sitting there asking me for this? I just bought you the $500 system and I bought and I bought you the game. And then you ain't you asking me for another 20 or 40 bucks for some VC, another 100 for the VC. Are you crazy? And then he probably, and then the crazy part is, he probably got some money for Christmas because, you know, a lot of times they give, if you get gifts like that for Christmas, you know, mom and dad, they're going to hit you with a with a hundred or something like that. They might have hit him with the hundred 
and he can't even get to Walmart to 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 get the uh, VC yet. Like it's crazy, man. You just need so much to get. Just some got to be done with this, bro. I don't know what they can do, but I think that having a mode where the characters are are start off at a higher level than 60 or something i think that would be more valuable than making the game free that's all i'm saying because even if the game were free he would have just got the game but they're not gonna buy him the v sizzle because they're gonna be like you got the game and i already bought you this it's always gonna be i already bought you this so i just think something like that will be um will be more beneficial uh having you start off at a higher level or have some test characters or at least have your character at 85 but then when you come out here to the to the park or something you know just have your character that you can grind up because once you get one character good you can grind your vc but for the initially bro they make you put that investment in i i don't agree with that pay to win aspect but i ain't gonna lie but yo at the same time we gotta have it to where people that don't have enough time can pay and get that character up so it's a double-edged sword, but it is what it is, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think now in the comment section, man. I feel bad for the kid, but you know, hey, he gonna grind it out. And uh, he on summer break anyway, so he just played nonstop for the next two weeks. He might be at 70 by the time it's time for him to go back to school. He should be good to go. But get out of them ones, my boy. Go and play some my career and sit on that bench. And I'm gonna holler at y'all next time to the next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Champ. Gosh, baby, gosh, baby.